Screen Team Media. What was it? Um, what was it? Tell me about a little bit about working with Rod, Robert Rodriguez. Um, he's such an inspiration. He, he's like a he's like a kid in a grown man's body. Like he he has brought kids' dreams uh, to life. Like because every kid dreams to be a spy kid um, because they want to have the cool gadgets. They want to be part of the OSS. And I think I think that's really cool how he did that. Robert Rodriguez is this amazing, amazing person who brings family to all his movies. Um, he basically discovered me. Um, so it's really, really amazing to get to work with such an inspiration. Um, so in the movie, what was it like to like work with all the like special stuff and save the world? Um, it was pretty cool, cool uh, getting to act like you're saving the world because um, <laughs> I mean, as I said, like, who doesn't want to have these super cool, awesome gadgets that do, like, awesome stuff? And getting to be a part of, like, a special agency called the OSS. I mean, <laughs> I think, it would, it's, I think awesome. it's pretty fun. Um, most of the backgrounds are green screen, so we weren't actually working yeah, with yeah. the background. So it was really cool to get to know that that, um, that happens. That's really cool. Yeah. So, what was it like to work with these two, like, awesome parents, like, um, yeah. <laughs> um, uh, working with Jessica and Joel, well, Jessica is very down to earth. Um, she is beautiful amazing, and amazing, amazing actor. Actress. Um, and Joel is so funny. He's actually very strong. He doesn't look he very is. strong, but He's he is. Very, very he picked he picked me and Rowan up by one arm one day. Joel <laughs> McHale has actually known me ever since I was born, so it was crazy getting to know that he booked this movie. And Jessica is an amazing, amazing actress. She's so talented and so beautiful and very, very down to earth. Um, so in the movie, you're not very happy. Well, one of you is not very happy to have a stepmom. But, like, if this was actually in real life, how do you think you would feel about this? Well, it's definitely, it's, I think it's, um, a lot of kids can relate to the position my character's in. Um, she, they, um, Cecil and Rebecca recently lost their mom. And it's a lot for them to handle, especially with the new stepmom coming in. And my character cannot accept that. She doesn't want anything to do with her stepmom. And then um, she has to eventually learn how to like her and live with her. Um, and what about your sister? Because it's not really a big part in the movie, but like, um, was it hard working with like a baby or anything? Or was it no. like... It, it, the baby was actually very sweet. Adorable. Um, yeah, they were actually twins. There was, it was... Uh, Annette and Jenny? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's... They looked exactly like, in case like one of them wasn't behaving or... One of them wasn't feeling well, mm -hmm. so they would always use the other baby. So, when you were working, was it like a real dog, like just like a real, like a dog, or was it like did they put him in? So um, were you like talking to an imaginary? They person? actually built um, this one fake dog, and then they have another real dog named Elmo. They would use the real dog for like any running, and if one dog was in the middle of midair, like he is in the movie, they would use the robot dog. And like how he was, uh, how. Argonaut was with me in the in the luge scene where I'm flying around and when we're flying around mm -hmm. in those rocket like luges, um, they he couldn't actually he wouldn't be able to uh, sit, sit there and spin twice, uh, so they used the fake the sitting fake dog. So why do you think that kids are gonna be like, like? Like, why are they going to be well, excited to see this? They're definitely going to love this movie. First, um, because it has a family lesson, and it involves all this action. It's an action-packed adventure movie. Uh, it has, uh, it's it's sort of like a movie for all ages, like parents, kids, teenagers, and um, because there's always a little something in there for everybody. And it involves a new dimension called 4D, yeah. which is basically bringing smell alive to the movie. Yeah, that's really cool. Awesome. Perfect. You guys were Thank great. You. Wow. Thank you. Thank you.